All right, Shalom Rastafari. This is a short segment, hopefully a long segment. Be upcoming. Check out this video right here. This is called Roman Empire Rules Today. This is a DVD one. All right, and this brother right here, I think he really does some really good research. And most folks will tell you about little secret societies, a Freemason here or there, or somebody doing something funny, you know, that's New World Order-ish. But let me just pull out right here so you can see it a little more clearly right here. This is from the video Roman Empire Rules Today, DVD 1. And basically, that's what it's all about, basically. It's all about Rome. It's all about Rome. The Kippur and the Guest will tell you, basically. Rome destroyed the faith, the king of Rome versus the king of Ethiopia. In other words, Antichrist versus Christ. The dragon versus the lion of the tribe of Judah. It's, it's just plain simple like that. But I like his, his overstanding here because he says up here, this is the so-called Holy See. What a kind of interesting name that is, Holy See. Not a sea like, like the, the sea, the water sea. You know what I'm saying? But a sea like somebody's looking at you. And it's interesting because the, the Vaticana intelligentsia is probably is better than most, all of the governments in the world probably combined, believe it or not, even though they have these infightings going on, but with the whole new, you know, Pope game and everything like that. Pope game is done, but they got a, a new Pope game has come, right? But let's look at this symbol right here for a moment, right? If you notice, this right here by Soma, this is the Illuminati, it's coming, it's coming, it's coming. But it's already here. It's already been here, right? There's been, what, the Third Reich? People are talking about three and a half years. So I want to just put this out there. Is it really that this thing is going to rule for three and a half years, as many um, believe? Or is it three and a half times? There was a Third Reich under Hitler. And then there was two previous Reichs. Could it be that as they build this fourth Reich, that Christos, that Christ, that the line of the tribe of Judah, the Lamb of God, will cut it off? Will just cut it off? It's interesting because this is what was put on the back of the dollar. I think circa, what was it, 30, in the 30s? It was 33 or something like that. And what does it say? Anut, coeptus, anuvos, ordo, seclorum or announcing the birth of the new order or the new order of the world or the new world order. This is a strictly Vaticana, a Latina. This is strictly the divining serpent right here, right? So it's already here. This symbol basically equals Rome. It basically equals um, Petrus Romanus, a corporate entity i.e. the Holy See, right? Three and a half years or three and a half times. Before they can complete the fourth world order, it is cut off. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Shalom Ras Tafari. This is Wendem Yadon of the Line of Jesus Society reporting.